Well, if they're not really getting married or spending their honeymoon here, then every reason I had for considering them is invalid. Well, that's wonderful. Well, they may not be spending their honeymoon here, but if this is the place where they got engaged and where they found out that they were having a child, then the bellflower may hold a special place in their hearts. I think that they might be the right choice to take over the hotel. No, wait. I think there's a creative way to make sure that the bellflower stays in good hands for a long time. I can leave the hotel to their child to make sure that it's guaranteed to stay in their family. I'll call my lawyer right now and have him get the paperwork ready. Can you call Becca and Todd and have them meet with you again tonight so you can deliver the good news? I'm a little confused why you asked us here. Yeah, I, do you still want to write about us in your book? Uh, we might have gotten this entire resort if you didn't ruin it. If I did it, you were the one who kept making up all those awful things about me. Because you're awful. Oh, my God. You're lying. There's no reason for him to leave anything to us, he's, let alone his whole casino. He's messing with us. This yeah. is his revenge for us lying to him before. Why would he leave it to us? Didn't you tell him that we aren't really getting married? Uh, Becca's not pregnant. Stop trying to ruin this. If we get married but never have a kid, we can keep the resort for ourselves. Think. So... So we have to get married and have a child together. Oh my, why would you tell him that I'm pregnant? God, why wouldn't you, why wouldn't you tell him the truth? No, we're not, we are, we are absolutely God, not. You're the one trying to ruin this, stop it. Okay, you're gonna be crazy if you think that I'm gonna have a kid with you. Mm -mm. Our kid would be filthy rich. Stop talking. I'm just saying. Stop think talking about it. and find us one of those Las Vegas wedding chapels. Yes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna find a doctor to handle the insemination. I, 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 well, there's a much easier way. <laughs> much easier way to do that. Do you want to be rich or not? I'm just saying we're not rich yet. Why don't we just do this the easy way? You handle your thing, go find the wedding chapel, no Elvis. I'm gonna find a lawyer to look over this to make sure it's not some sort of sick prank. Okay, and then, and then about getting pregnant? We will talk about that later, okay? Sounds Ugh. like a yes to me. So what makes you interested in adoption? Uh, we just realized that we were meant to be parents, mm -hmm. isn't that right? We would love to adopt a terminally ill child if you have any. Mm -hmm. That's an unusual request. Well, we just have big hearts, isn't that right, dear? Mm -hmm. yeah. We also inherited a very large resort and casino with the clause that we have to have a child in order to get it. <clears throat> yeah. Are you telling me the only reason you want to adopt a child is so you can inherit this hotel? You realize I have to do what's in the best interest of the child, right? And a mm -hmm. child will have a wonderful life here at the casino. I mean, I would have died to be a filthy rich child. Careful. Oh, right. I, I can take them to Disney World every day. Yeah. I'm sorry, but this does not seem like a healthy environment for a child to grow up in. We can give you a quarter of a million dollars. <laughs>